Hey everyone, here are some important and final updates of the semester. So from now until the end of the week, it is 24-7 quiet hours. So those started at 1 a.m. this morning um, on Sunday. And so what that means is you need to be quiet, as quiet as possible, uh, for the rest of the week until 8 a.m. Friday morning. Uh, we have these quiet hours to um, help people focus on studying for finals and have the limited and reduced noise so that people can focus on studying for finals. Um, from 5 to 6 p.m. is when we encourage people if you need to vacuum or deal off your bed. Um, it's still a courtesy hours from 5 to 6 p.m. and so it doesn't mean that you can be super loud but if you need to make some noise from like moving and like I said from deal off your bed or vacuuming uh, we encourage you to do that from 5 to 6 p.m. This is also a reminder that you have to be out of the residence halls by 10 a.m. this Friday, December 21st. Um, if you do not have a J-term contract signed um, starting that day, you have to be out of the residence halls by 10 a.m. on Friday. Uh, to help reduce noise and um, disruptions in the residence halls, we encourage you to leave within 24 hours of completing your finals. Um, the only caveat to that is if you've coordinated a room move with your hall director, um, some of those room moves might not be able to be completed until the end of the week. Um, but otherwise, when you're done with your finals, we do encourage people to leave within 24 hours of completing that last final. And finally, staff will be doing room checks. So staff will be coming into your rooms, pods, or suites, and we will be checking to make sure that the um, leaving for winter break checklist items have been completed. And so we're actually going to walk through a few of the things that need to be done. But again, just a reminder that staff will be coming in and checking your space to make sure um, the items have been completed and also check for policy violations um, that may be in the rooms. So if you're not sure what you need to do before leaving for winter break, um, you can look at this orange sheet that will be taped to your door. Um, it has a checklist of things that you need to do. And then also, if you're not sure what constitutes as a policy violation, uh, you can refer back to the student guide and planner that you should have. Um, this is the same planner that everyone in our department uses. All the hall directors refer to this, all the RAs refer to this, and this is the same planner that um, you should have received at the beginning of the year. It has all of our policies outlined. So again, if you have any question on what is and what is not a policy violation, um, I encourage you to look at this book and then the checklist. Um, you can also look on the bulletin boards in your hall, and you can also look at the orange sheet that should be taped to your door. We encourage all students to defrost the refrigerators. Um, we won't be checking this unless both roommates have moved out of the room, but it's still a good idea to remove any items in your fridge that might um, go bad or rotten or spoil over winter break. And again, it's also a good idea to defrost your fridge um, because the ice can build up and you don't want to have to defrost a huge chunk of ice at the end of the year. You also need to make sure your windows are shut. Uh, just double check that both window panes are shut. So we got the first window pane and the second. So again, make sure both window panes are shut. Um, there should be four sets of window panes. Make sure both are shut on each side. And then also make sure to shut your blinds. And this is a special reminder for those living in Johnson Hall. Uh, please do not have anything hanging on your pipes. This is a part of our room decoration policy, and so nothing can be hanging on the pipes anywhere in the room. So please make sure that the pipes in your room uh, do look like this um, to avoid any policy violations. Please also make sure to remove the trash from your room. Uh, if anything could be in the garbage cans that could go rotten over break, it could create a uh, disturbance in the hall from the smell of stuff rotting so please just take out all your trash before you leave and you can get um, fresh liners from the front desks and so just be sure to take out your garbage. So a couple things not shown uh, in this video uh, appliances unplugged uh, do keep your fridge plugged in and if you have an aquarium or fish tank keep that plugged in but everything else you should unplug. Um, outlet strips off the floor uh, make sure you turn your lights off when you leave and please make sure that you lock your door. Uh, this can be a high theft time with a lot of people um, going in and out of rooms and as always please always lock your doors. So best wishes as you go into your finals and I hope you have a good winter break and if you have any questions about anything with closing please reach out um, to your RA or your hall director. Thanks!